All right, morning all. We've arrived here in Kettlewell and uh, we're going to go up uh, Great Wernside, which is over there. Look at this beautiful Kettlewell. Okay, I'll catch you up in a while when I've uh, sorted my map out. to do Great Wernside as a hike. No tent today. And it's uh, lovely, it's gonna be a lovely day, I think. So, all right, we'll crack on. I'll catch you up in a bit. There's somebody waiting to go to work there. Hello, good boy. <laughs> right, hang on. Hello, sheepies. This looks like an old chapel and a graveyard, yeah. All right. All right. Somebody's house now. 1860. Looking like nice weather today. Just right. Oh. Who doesn't love the Yorkshire Dales, eh? Get great way inside the hag dike two miles. Right, let's crack on. I've just come through the style and we're going up slightly. We're going up to the path to the right of the one, the main path. It looks more interesting. Up to Hag Dyke. We just talked to a doggy who was very friendly and enjoyed e eating sheep poo. Yeah, this is uh, where it gets a bit steeper. Uh, Those are the first intake wall. Uh. All right going on up there I think. Right you lot, out the way girlies, out the way, good girl. Come on you, come on. Yeah. Nice view of Kettlewell down there. Come up, it's quite a, quite a push up there. Yeah. Right, continue. Limestone wall still. I think that's Buckdon Pike, where I camped a few weeks back. And we're heading on up here to Great Wernside. Yeah, lovely valley. And then coming up, there's a gritstone band there, I think. That's pretty much uh, Summit Ridge, I think, just below. So we'll press on through the next few gates. I'll catch you when. Uh, Come up to the grit, gritstone band. And that is a beautiful one. Look at that. Beautiful shape, isn't it? We've got the first gritstone walls here, and I'm hearing curlews. It's brightening up nicely. So we'll head up up there. Gritstone walls, gritstone rock, there's your source of rock. Right, press on. We're up as far as Hagdyke now, which I think is a converted farm. There you go. Great Wernside. Oh, thank you very much. Get a bit of pressure on that. Right. Oh. Dyke. But we're heading off up this grit stone band. So I'll leave you till we get to the top of this. 
Oh, there's Hag Dyke coming up here and up this here rock band. Bit of a grit stone there. Uh, not too, not too uh, serious. It's a nice rock formation. There. A bit of a push up there. Oh. And again. There's the top, and Clag's come in a bit. Okay, so we've come up that gritstone ledge, and we've come up over that. There's a nice easy gradient, and uh, the peat's pretty uh, dried up, so it's not so boggy even. And then, uh, so now we're gonna go up here as the last stiff push up to the summit. Summit's not far beyond there. So, uh, doing good. That's Buckdon Pike. Now crack on a bit. So I've come along this uh, nice easy gradient on the shelf above the gritstone, first gritstone uh, edge. And then you come up and then there's a bit of nice paved path. Um, on the final push and it's not as steep as it looks it's not bad at all not for too far from the summit now not bad at all this path not too steep it tapers across like about 45 degrees and uh, nicely paved not as steep as it looks I don't know if this is a false summit though I'll soon find out, eh? Right, we're on the uh, very last bit. Getting much windier, as you can tell. get down there and we'll get a brew. Plenty of places to pitch here, isn't there? Over there, it's Buckland Pike. You can come round here. There's an ancient British defensive uh, rampart there, the ridge of uh, Great Wernside. So, uh, yeah, not bad. Throw to a Windmaster stove out. Nice custom made uh, stove bag. Spin that, spin that up. That's it. And I'll uh, catch you in a bit. I'll tell you what. That is the mommy and daddy of all cheese sandwiches from a burger wagon just um, outside Skipton on the Clitheroe side. I mean, that's enough for me tea as well. Good grief. Little Nescafe caramel sachet. Milk and, milk and sugar in it. Temple repair. Improvise. Windmaster fired up first time as per normal. What's that birdie? There we go. 
we got her got her going here and that'll give me a brew in about a minute and a half and this is uh, my summit brew up <laughs> You know, it's, it's windy and that stove is not blowing out as per normal. No guy, no uh, shield on it. Nice pitch here. And I think you could get a pitch no matter which way the wind was blowing. You could get around one of these big uh, rocks. And it's looking around to the summit. That's where I had my uh, lunch. Then off back down now, uh, slightly different way. It's been a good trip. Cleared up a bit. You can see Penigent over there, Engelborough over there, Wernside there, Berksfell uh, camped on the other week, and that's uh, Buckingham Pike. Yeah, and over here is that ancient British fortification. So, uh, get my sticks and we're, we'll be on our way. Come back down to the uh, bit of pavement. Just up that uh, grit stone edge. And uh, we're heading down there, back the way we came, but I think I'll go right, uh, go down a different way from there, from Hag Dyke. Yeah. people starting to come up now yeah great stuff this would be a bit uh, boggy if it had been uh, raining but it hasn't so it's almost dry we just come from down from up there you can hear the curlews down again back at the uh, cairn on top of the, the crag sun's coming out of it now all right so we're heading off down this rocky uh, band there's hag dyke again but i think we're gonna go right that way towards the valley back down at uh, Hag Dyke and uh, stripped off my layers because it's getting warm somebody's left the gate open there I'm going to take a different slightly different route down come down that uh, band there nice little little bit loose but nice track all right, let's get this gate shut. Down to the right now. Here's the curlews. Got my uh, Foreign Legion hat on now. <laughs> covers your ears, covers the back of your neck. It's a lot brighter than it was when I went up. Look at these stone walls. See, these are all uh, grit stone up here, as opposed to limestone on the lower levels. All right, so we're heading off over this top. Really good views of Buckden Pike and uh, Berksfell. to those curlews. Just up over this crest we'll get a better view. Wow. Oh that looks uh, nice that ravine up there. That wooded ravine. Looking back towards Great Wernside. Right, 
top of this crest now we're going down here and along that track down into that valley oh curly right there just took off i think she's a bit upset don't want me to get near her nest these lapwings are not happy with me it's like an alarm call i think i've obviously got a nest nearby yeah <laughs> just circling around me curly who's a busy as well i know love i'm getting out of your way as soon as i can <laughs> Not happy with me that that birdie. So I've come down the uh, track from Hag Dyke. When you get down from uh, Great Wernside to Hag Dyke, then through the gate and uh, fork right on the main track, and this is the one that now comes down into the valley. On the bridle way down towards Kettlewell. Sun's come out beautiful now. Good route, good route up and down via Hag, Hag Dyke. Well, it is in this kind of weather because all the bogs are dry. Very nice picturesque country dirt track. Fantastic. What's not to like? How are you doing? How are you doing? You alright, chick? Yeah. Carry on a bit more. Nice flowers. Look at that, gorgeous everywhere, isn't it? That's the stream I crossed on the way up when I started. Listen to that. Fantastic. We're nearly back at the village now. Nice day, isn't it? Well, there's the King's Head in Kettlewell. Let's have a look this side. Beautiful. What a lovely place. You were still there. I saw you in the morning, didn't I? Yeah, I hope you're all right. Good boy. What a place, eh? Blue Bell Inn, Racehorse Hotel. Alright, let's have a look around here. Nearly back at the car now. There, the Yorkshire Dales car park. It's about 5.50 for the day. And over the other side of the road, Three quid. Sticks in, hat in, hat and pack in. Right, get in the car. Right, we're back down. Uh, it was only about five miles. 
two and a half miles up and about the same back and we've just completed Great Wernside one of the Dales 30s uh, parked up in uh, three quid for the day parking but you've got to get here early just uh, on the east side of the bridge at Kettlewell I hope you enjoyed this little one and uh, probably do a wild camp next one uh, if you like the video don't forget to like and subscribe Thank you very much. See you on the next one.